Hello my crafty friends. We have more cards and tags to share. Let me grab a sip to drink real quick. Sorry about that. My lips are parched. It's uh, quite dry in the house today. So the um, first card that I received was from Misty and I just showed that video. But the second card I received was from Sabrina. She is the mixed matched crafter here on YouTube. She also sent um, a box of goodies for me for Christmas and she included these two sweet little vintage style tags. They're just so cute. And she put to pee, uh, lovely handwriting. Um, and I plan on um, glittering these up and making them into Christmas ornaments for my tree. I think they're just so cute and with a little bit of uh, vintage glitter, I think they'll be darling on the tree. So that's what I plan on doing with these. And then here is her adorable little card. Um, Sabrina has a love for gnomes. She loves a good gnomey. And so she created these by hand, um, this little gnome card. And I think it's just adorable. And of course she did it in blue and gray because she knows those are my colors. Um, I love any shade of gray and I love pretty much every shade of blue. So, um, it says gnome for Christmas. It's just so cute. And then it says, we wish you a Merry Christmas from our gnome to yours. Sabrina, Jamie, and Zachary. And, and she colored up another little gnome girl there. And she has handmade by Sabrina. That's so cute. The... And she even stamped the envelope with gnomes on it. Isn't that adorable? I absolutely love it. And then the next card, or I should say, it was kind of a mini package, came from Sue Crozier. Um, Sue had made a beautiful tag in her stuff for Jill. And um, I fell in love with it, and she was kind enough to send me some images. Um, I will not share the images here on YouTube because I don't think that's right. Um, it is a out-of-print stamp. It's retired, no longer available. Um, I don't uh, condone stamping for friends unless it is a stamp that is no longer available. Okay? Um, and so she made me this beautiful, beautiful tag. She's got some... Uh, uh, eyelash yarn on here, a little tassel that she's made, a little stitch tag that says warm winter wishes, and this tag is cross stitched, you guys. Look at that. She has cross stitched all the way around that, and when I saw these, I didn't know that these existed. I mean, I did, but I didn't. I mean, I had known that there were cross stitched dies, but I didn't realize that you actually cross stitch with thread in them, I guess is what I'm going to say. Um, I was kind of out of the loop, I guess. <laughs> but anyway, she made this gorgeous tag. Um, pink glitter and navy blue. I love the blue. And then just the background is just a homespun and she has signed it. And so that is a beautiful decoration that we will cherish. Thank you so much, Sue. It was so kind of her to um, send these to me. And then she also made me a little tag in an envelope. Just sweet as can be. And here is the little image. Isn't he cute? I absolutely love it. And then this is just a little envelope that she had made. Just as sweet as it can be. And here was the little card that was inside. And um, I don't remember if she... Yeah. Um, and so that's just really cute. And then the background. She put another piece of paper. Um, I think this is Prima, if I remember right. It looks like Prima. And that's sweet. It's just a sweet little card. Um, I absolutely love it. She put little hearts on it. So thank you so much, Sue. My next card came um, from Anna White. Anna, thank you so, so, so much. Anna knows I love buttermilk basin. I am a huge fan of buttermilk basin. Um, she is a uh, sewing company. Um, she's done stamps through the years. I'm assuming this is a buttermilk basin, Anna. Of course, she has watercolored it. Gorgeous. I absolutely love 
this snowman, this card. She put plaid in the background, a little piece of ribbon and a button, a blue button no less, and some of that twine that we all love. She splattered it with, or sprayed it with a silver dust. It's just gorgeous. Thank you so much, Anna. And then um, she just says, P, Merry Christmas to you and yours. Hope you keep cozy this winter. Burr here and gobs of snow. Much crafty love to you, Anna. And just so very sweet. And she has lovely handwriting too. And then she has stamped it on the back with one of her designs of a little snowman. It says, Handmade by Anna White. I love him, Anna. He is so cute. I love this card. It's adorable. She even decorated the envelope, but because of addresses and privacy, I'm not going to show that, but I absolutely love this card. Thank you so much, Hannah. The next card came from one of my girls, Tracy's Treasures 24. Um, she's extremely busy with three girls and two grandsons, and every year she multiplies makes multiple cards in the same form and she makes them as easy as she possibly can and I don't blame her one bit that's I, I'm here for it anyway she made this little card for me it's a sparkling winter wishes and then she just sends us all the best for Christmas as always thank you Tracy um, again I'll have the links to everybody's channels down below in the description box so that if you would like to go visit their channels you may do so. So that is my cards and my tags that I received for Christmas. Um, I Like again I said um, earlier that I received some from family but I don't share those. Um, and I want to thank you all for um, stopping by today. I do want to tell you that there um, are a few people that I still owe tags to. Tina Bean, I have not forgotten your cardinal tag. It's sitting in my sewing machine waiting for some ribbon. I know it'll come late, but I will be shipping that off because I know that you did want that tag. I had um, every intention of sending every person who participated in the um, Tags for Jill a Christmas card, but I ran very far behind due to... Um, due to my back. We'll just say that. Um, it, we had a lot of um, mishaps during appointments where I was supposed to get treatment. We'll just say that. Um, but anyway, I will be sending out Valentine's cards, I, I assume. Um, and I'm going to try to start working on those soon so I can get those done. I have lots of things in the stew pot, so to speak. Um, so we'll see what this uh, this next year brings. But anyway, thanks everybody for watching. Um, I hope that you've enjoyed seeing all the tags and the cards. Um, again, the links will be down below. Um, and I hope that you guys will go and pay a visit to all of these lovely, lovely ladies. They are very good friends of mine and um, have been with me through thick and thin. And... Um, uh, have been an ear for me this this last year. So thanks everybody for watching. I hope you make a happy memory and I'll talk to you soon. Bye-bye.